everybody, I'm Heather, and you're watching r, &R TV, and I am here in Virginia at the Stillborn Fest with the Casualties. Well, you guys want to introduce yourself, and you are? Rick. And what do you do, Rick? I don't really do much of anything. Rick doesn't do much of anything. <laughs> do you sing? Do you play guitar? I do a little, yeah. I do a little showmanship. I jump around, act like an idiot. Pretend amps. amps. <laughs> I break a lot of bass amps. amps is what I do. Yeah, he's the amp breaker. And you are? I'm Jake. I play guitar. Jake plays guitar. And Lead you are? guitar. Lead guitar. Okay, and you are? My name is Meggers. I play drums. And you play drums. I do. I'm good. And you guys are from Jersey, New York? New York City. New York City? Yeah. And how long have you guys... Jersey um, City. Some of us migrated to the other side for cheaper rent. Long Island. <laughs> it's not very cool, but that's where I'm from. And how long have you guys been together? A uh, long time. Band's been a band for almost 20 years, but we, I've been in the band for like 16 years, you know? But we were like all like like high school kids when we were joined, so it was like, took a long time to like, oh, you know, start touring and stuff, you know, so. The first days were just like playing for beer money and stuff like that, yeah. Have you guys been toured overseas at all, or? Yeah, like, we've, we've been to m almost every continent except Africa and Antarctica. Can't play Antarctica though. And how's how's the crowd over there compared to over here? Just got back from South America. It was awesome. Cause they're into like punk rock, metal, uh, hardcore. Like big is like bigger down there than probably anywhere right now. And do you guys currently have a CD that's out? That guy's got a scarf on. Yeah, we have a CD. It's called We Are All We Have, and that's the one we're touring on now. We have a video too for it, and um, we'll be playing a bunch of songs from it tonight here in Springfield. Yeah. What was it like making the video? Because I know performing, it's got to be easier than it is in front of a camera doing a video. We did it. We did it on the roof of my building where I live. So we didn't like. There was like no like. Uh, you know, it wasn't a bunch. It wasn't a bunch of setup. It was just like, dude, let's do it on the roof. Like we're a street punk band, so it's like it, it fits it. Like you know, like real down. We didn't want a bunch of like fake stuff. We just wanted to be us in a real setting. And just like, you know, so it took a couple takes. It was like the whole day, and it was the hottest day of the summer on a black tar roof. Yeah. So we're sweating up there. If you, if you see the video, you can be like, oh, you, you'll be able to tell. Yeah. <laughs> so what type of message do you have in, in all your CDs that are out? Do they change up, like, per members in your band? Or do you guys kind of have the same vibe that goes? No, we have the same. We sing a lot about, like, daily life, what goes on with us, and, like, uh, our last record had a lot of political topics because of the whole George Bush regime was happening at the time. And we, we just sing a lot about life, a lot about just living, working, like a like working class vibe, paying your bills, dealing with family, dealing with like life issues, because that's what we go through. So we just kind of sing about stuff we know. You've been in the van for 12 and 16 years. This guy's you, been you in guys, the van way longer. You guys have been in the van for a long time. Well, How do you guys cope with each other? <laughs> we had a bus for a little while and an RV, and then all those, well, we, the RV broke down. It's still on the side of the road in Florida, and so we had to get a van, you know. And then uh, we're doing Warp Tour coming up this summer, so probably see us in a broken down RV again. And who's on the Warp Tour? <laughs> who, who are you guys looking forward to playing with? I know that Alkaline Trio is on Warp Tour. That's it. Us and Al that's the only two bands I know of. Yeah. Are there any other like your favorite favorite bands that you would want to like play on stage with? Andrew WK. Yeah, Andrew <laughs> WK. Is, he's like our our modern day Twisted Sister. So, not not like we're kind of different from a lot of the bands that are on the Warp Tour. So we're kind of like one of the like harder like punk style bands that would be on that. So we probably don't like kick it with that many bands on Warped Tour, you know, not that everybody does their own thing, but we're kind of like a little bit of a little bit of a separatist, you know. They just don't know how to hang, huh? No, no, we do pretty all right with that. It's just that, you know, we don't, I guess, mix well with like straight edge and stuff like that, you know, as far as, as far as like hanging out, you know, we like to have a couple of drinks and stuff. So. so you guys have how many CDs out? It's seven, seven now. now. It's our seventh studio album that just came out in August. Okay, and you only have how long to play? Uh, tonight. 40 minutes, did you give us? Yeah, 40 minutes. So we try, we're we not going to talk at all, just go from song to song. Yeah, it's got to be difficult trying to pick out which ones you know everybody wants to hear. Plus, you want to do your new ones also. So how many songs do you have off your new one? Like five or six, I think. About five or six. Yeah, we squeeze about like 
six. Maybe you can throw one in there and do six tonight? Yeah. No, we're going to do a good half of it. Good half? Yeah. And are there certain songs that you do all the time, or you try to mix it up? I didn't hear you. <laughs> Are there certain songs that you try to do all the time that you know your fans want to hear, or do yeah. you try to mix it up? Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, Tomorrow Belongs to Us, An Unknown Soldier. Like, those are ones that are always kind of staples in the set, you know? Cool. Well, how many more places do you go to after tonight? Uh, we have Poughkeepsie, Vermont, and Connecticut. So, three more. Yeah, yeah so how was your Christmas? I mean... We and holidays. <laughs> what do you do? We at our house. Oh, yeah. We came back for Christmas from South America, and we were just there for, like, like two or three days. And then we're going right out to Europe, hopefully, like, on January 7th, if, like, everything goes as planned. Okay. And that's that's the Warp Tour, right? No, no, that's just Europe, a European tour. And uh -huh. then we, when we get back from that, we might do a little bit of Canadian stuff, and then we got to wait because you're not supposed to play in between – uh, you're not supposed to play in the U.S. until Warp Tour is like a certain amount of months. You got to not play. Uh -huh. So we're gonna be, and then we're gonna be on Warp Tour for the summer. So. For the summer. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm um, looking forward to it. And again, these guys are the casualties, and I'm Heather, and this is RNR TV.